What's up? It's Gigi Diaz with iHeartRadio and 93.9 MIA. Now, you know I love to bring you all kinds of different stuff to this vlog. So today, I am in the wonderful company of Chef Hector with the Diaz doing? Spices. I'm doing great because I'm about to eat some of this. Oh, yes. <laughs> this is going to be amazing. So first of all, talk to me about this dish in particular that we have here. Sure. It's called jollof rice, right? It's jollof rice from West Africa. Mm -hmm. It's a staple in West Africa. And we're going to marry the, all the spices that the Diaz Spice has put into the jar. So you don't have to go around shopping for different herbs and spices. Everything is in one jar. And we're going to marry it with the Badia Extra Virgin Olive Oil. It's going to create a beautiful marriage with the peppers and onions and the serrano ham. And wow, the aroma just steadily coming out of there. I was just going to say that. If it's, only you could smell how good this smells right here. Now, talking about the Extra Virgin Olive Oil, we do have something very special going on with Badia, which is 5% of these one liter bottles. All the profits are going to the Dan Marino Foundation. So when you're cooking this, it's not only delicious, it's not only very simple. As you can see, this is a one pot meal, but you will be giving back to the Dan Marino Foundation. Now, let's Absolutely. talk a little bit about the ingredients in here. What do we have? A uh, very simple ingredient, the, the jollof fry seasoning. We have tomato okay. puree. We have uh, uh, peppers, red pepper, onions, and uh, olive oil, and serrano ham. And we, we just, it's like a sofrito line. Okay. We make a sofrito, we th throw the ham in, we th throw the tomato in, okay. then we throw the rice in to coat it with a extra virgin badilla olive oil. Once that's nice and coated and married together with nice aroma, then we throw the water in, and then we stir it up and cover it up, lower the temperature a little bit to medium high, and let it cook for 40 minutes and you're done. So I love it because first of all, it's very simple. The ingredients mm -hmm. are, you just toss them all in the same spot. It's none of this, uh, not too much measuring, not too much stress, comfort and in 45 food. minutes, you're ready to go. It's called comfort food. It's Medea my favorite comfort kind of food. food. <laughs> Definitely, <laughs> easy. What are some different additions that you could do to this? I know you said the serrano ham is the way that we're making it today. Well, you, could, you could use chicken. Okay. You could use shrimp, make it like Louisiana style. Okay. And uh, you could also use the jollof rice seasoning uh -huh. in soup. If you want to spice up a nice chicken a noodle soup, Spanish style, uh -huh. drop some some of that seasoning in there and you're good to go. So it's definitely a very versatile spice, oh, right? Yes, you can definitely. kind of mix and add it to whatever sure, you want. Sure, now sure. when you serve this dish, in just a few minutes when it's mm. ready to eat. And uh, what, what do you serve it with? What sides do you recommend? Do you even need any? It's so it, beautiful. If you really want to add something, just have a little salad, okay. a nice glass of wine or ice cold beer to complement it. And uh, I tell you, by the time you're through, you're gonna fall asleep. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Okay, so we've, we've waited her 45 minutes and this is almost ready. Do I get to try this or what? Because it smells amazing. I'll tell you what, <laughs> definitely, because I'm ready to try myself. All right, let's see. Oh my God, look at that steam. It looks there. amazing. This dish is absolutely gorgeous. Wow, it's first of all. The aroma. Let's grab a little spoon out of here. Yeah, let's uh, do it in a little plate. Uh, okay. Do it gently. Let's see what we got here. And beautifully. Also have forks. Wow. Let's try that. All right, let's see. It's definitely very hot, so. It's got some ham in here. Mmm. Uh, wow. I see what you mean about the spices, mm -hmm. where it's not like a burn, it's more of a flavorful, flavor, warm. Absolutely, absolutely. This is delicious. Okay, so we definitely want you guys to try this recipe at home. If you're gonna alter it, like Chef Hector said, and you're right. gonna put uh, either chicken, chicken or, shrimp. or shrimp, you can mix it up right, to make definitely. it more uh, comfortable for your own taste. Also, you can make it spicier than this, or you can soften Add up more the spice. spice to it. Definitely a flexible uh, recipe for you guys to enjoy. Thank you so much for coming out. Once you try this at home, make sure to tag Badia Spices. Make sure to tag us in it so we see what you guys did with it and how it right. turned out. And we do want to remind you, until December 31st, anytime you buy one of these one liter uh, extra virgin olive oil bottles, 5% of the profits get donated to the Dan Marino Foundation. Once again, Chef Hector, thank you so much That's for joining us. I'm going to eat some more of this. You get to cooking and tag us and let us know how it turned out. I'm Gigi Diaz for iHeartRadio and 839 MIA. Enjoy. <laughs>